Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today we have got a very interesting product. It's uh, Sphero Mini. Yes, this has been in the market for a long time and we wanted to do a review on this. But um, you know what, we, we actually waited a bit and uh, we wanted to check this out in the channel without further wasting time. Let's open this box and see what they have to offer inside. Opening the box is pretty easy. You just have to toggle this and uh, take this part out and uh, after that you keep this aside this is the sphero mini who we'll keep this aside and uh, inside this there is this tiny tiny packaging and you will say that uh, packed with play and you take this out like this when, when you unbox this I'm pretty sure it's on the other side also so when you have done that you will see this box comes out separately so we'll keep the box separately and uh, we are going to find something inside which we are going to check it out right you are going to see all the instructions written out here so you open this it tells you to download the sphero app so go ahead and download the sphero app you open this up it will also show you to charge this ball and you charge this the way it is and it takes an hour to charge or gives you an hour of full charge and after that you open the second part of the leaflet and you won't, don't find anything <laughs> okay so inside the box uh, there is a very interesting uh, stuff inside the box so at first forget all the manuals you're going to get this uh, my usb to micro usb cable to charge and you'll get tiny stuff or uh, you know like uh, kind of uh, bowling devices and you'll get small cones also which we are going to check out again in the channel so inside the box you're going to find this uh, small pins that you can use for the Sphero Mini and uh, there are also some small cones which are included so that you can use the Sphero Mini to do a lot of stuff okay so let's go and see the cones that are included in the box. So inside the box you're going to find these three cones and uh, you can use these cones to navigate through all of your devices so you can use uh, these three cones in various ways so this ball is your case also so this thing is a case itself and when you open it up the sphero mini lies inside it comes in very different colors so you can uh, get all those colors also and you can later on just keep this and you can store your uh, what is that's called sphero mini inside this box and throw it in a backpack to anybody who is three and above so at above age three you can actually give this because these have tiny parts which uh, cause choking hazard and stuff like that so when you twist the ball it will open up so keep on twisting it and uh, you will see that it opens up so inside this it's a very interesting thing that it is there is a magnet and this whole thing moves inside the magnet and it glows up so this is the charging port that's how you need to charge the ball uh, i don't know whether there is juice left or not but i'm going to check this out so let's put this back together so there are two sort of apps the first app is a sphero play and then the sphero edu and you can download both of them if you want i'm actually going to download only the play uh, if you are doing coding uh, you can use uh, the sphero edu also Alrighty, guys uh, so we just charged up the sphero mini as you can see the mini is charged up got this tiny light but this tiny light also will show you uh, which direction to go and stuff like that so open up the sphero play app on this thing so once you open the sphero mini app and go and select mini as your robot and uh, we are going to keep uh, the robot close to your device and you will see suddenly it tries to pair and everything and uh, so aiming is uh, about holding the ball towards you and see whichever way the uh, the light is so so we are going to bring the light to this side okay so it's a very very you know like according to your uh, palm and everything so I'm not a good pilot or anything but was this so you can actually use the joystick to uh, to use this you can use your sphero mini as a game control so for example let's go and check uh, my favorite game exile 2 so exile 2 opens up and you can this robot is used as that so once you open this let's go ahead and play you will see that uh, it actually does uh, so there you go so basically 
moving this bot actually gives you uh, this thing okay so you have to keep it in the uh, keep it in the direction light speed drifter in light speed drifter what you can do is that this uh, you can use with one finger also so let's see how we can use this so reach the end of the level before the time runs out okay so okay so this one this is a little bit tricky okay it's a little bit tricky uh, but yeah so basically you have to hit the directional arrows all the time so yeah otherwise those are obstacles dang this is a little bit tricky challenging and i love challenges you know like so there you go so that's how you can play the drifter and the last uh, one will be you're another game which they call it uh, the round trip so in round trip what it does is that there is a pentagon that opens up and you need to keep the ball inside the pentagon so let's go and play this so that's all you have to keep the ball in the pentagon uh, scream drive you can do scream drive or you can even do kick so what is kick kick is something like flick and kick and tap to trap uh, so you can you can actually do a flick and uh, what's this so that's your flick you can go and use this as slingshot and you're gonna pull this like this so there you go guys if you like this uh, review of the sphero mini give me a big big thumbs up and do subscribe to this uh, channel this tiny bot is insanely crazy and you will have a lot of fun playing with this bot and uh, i definitely am sure that you guys are going to enjoy it so take care and uh, we'll meet you again in another episode and i would highly recommend you this as christmas gifts for your kids and everything so uh, take care and see you later again in the channel with some more surprises